welcome back to my channel, Warpaint. I'm Tam Michelle. I wanted to bring you a quick haul. I want to see if you guys like these types of hauls. Because I'm not really sure. I didn't pick up a lot of things. I literally have like, I don't want to tell you how many items I have to show you. It's very small. But I thought it would be fun to do different types of hauls that are like, I spent $50 and under. I spent $100 and under. That type of thing. Because I feel like sometimes I get overwhelmed when I'm watching people's hauls because I'm like, dang, even if they're collective because I'm like, I want everything in their video but I can't get it because they spent like $300 and sometimes that's just not a wise thing to do is to spend your money like that. So I kind of wanted to do like budget friendly hauls. So this one was $50 and under and I got some good stuff and I wanted to share it with you. I went to Target in the mall. Um, just basically Target and Macy's. So I wanted to show you a couple things. The thing I got at Target. Oh and there's ColourPop in this too. The thing I got at Target I really wanted to show you. I showed you guys on Snapchat. If you're not following me on Snapchat. I'm this name right here. Tara.m. Tara.michelle5. And I got this hat at Target. I don't know if it's going to look very good on camera. But I really like it in person. I don't know. I'm going to keep it on. I've been wearing it all day. We went to the museum. And I literally wore it like inside, but I had no shame. So anyway, I got this hat at Target. It's by Morona. It's $19.99. If you guys can find it, there is a brown version of it. It's so cute. Like, it's so flattering. And one thing that I have a problem with with these types of hats is I've never found that one was big enough because I have really thick hair. So to get it like around my ears and my hair was all nearly impossible. So when I put this on, I was like, I found it. I have found the hat and it's felt so it's really good transition from summer to winter and all that jazz and it's it's kind of expensive but I think it's a really fun accessory it changes every outfit into just like this cute cute outfit okay so the next thing I got to target this boring but it's so necessary and I use it every day of my life and I had to get a new container of it and I never really talk about it I have before back in the past but it's time to bring it out again it's the Neutrogena smooth sensation body lotion this one is in the dry skin formula and it's in between a light and rich moisturizer this has shea butter and hydro IQ in it and it is the best I use it after I shave I use it every single day all over my body um, it's so nice that it's one of the few lotions that I'm like okay with putting it on <laughs> um what do I mean like putting it on every day like taking the time to put it on I'm, I'm willing to do it because it's so good so I definitely recommend this as a body lotion I don't think you have to have super high end stuff for it to work so the next two things are pretty identical but I've been waiting for this one to come in the mail so that I could include it in a haul because I wanted to have it in my last haul but I'm glad I waited because now I get to do a little mini under $50 haul for you and that is the ColourPop Lippy um, the Ultra Matte Lip in Shimmy is the color I got. It's like a blue toned pink. I've yet to wear it. Um, so it's their matte formula. And the last item that I got was, I'm, I don't have any of these, the Anastasia Beverly Hills Liquid Lipstick in Pure Hollywood. Now this is a nude color. And I wanted to try these and see the comparison. So as you can see, the package is are pretty close in size. Let's see how big the ColourPop one is. The ColourPop one is 3.2 grams and the Anastasia one is 3.2 grams. So they're the same exact size. The Anastasia one is $20 and the ColourPop one is 5 So I wanted to put the ColourPop one on. I don't have a mirror. Um, we're going to just go with the whole selfie cam right now and I'm gonna put it on the ColourPop one because I've been wearing Pure Hollywood all day um, I don't have it on my lips but I want to go ahead and swatch it and then I'll swatch it next to you and I'll let you know what I think initially of the ColourPop formulation so it goes on like it feels really dry like already really wearable color so I could like test it every single day even if I'm at work. Ooh, I really like it with this look, actually. Okay, so let me swatch it on the back of my hand. So here is, I already have like a tiny swatch from the car. Ooh, it's so pretty. Chamois. 
and here is Pure Hollywood next to it. Now I've been wearing Pure Hollywood and I have my thoughts. I'm actually going to do a video on matte lipstick so you'll get your full on review. I'm really going in depth with the whole matte look here. So here is Pure Hollywood and here is Shimmy. And Shimmy is on my lips. I really like it. It's interesting how it dried already. So I'll have to see what I think. But anyway, that's literally like my haul. So this was 20 and this was 5 making 25 and this was $20 so that makes 45 and then the lotion is um, under $5. It's like $4.49 so that's under $50. I hope you guys like these types of videos. If you think it's a waste to only see four things <laughs> that I bought, um, constructive criticism is always welcome but I thought it would be fun because you know, you don't always have hundreds of dollars to spend, and it is hard to watch hauls because it makes you lust after things, and I think that it makes life a little bit hard. But that's one thing that I didn't do when I was on my no-buy. I didn't watch hauls, and I thought, oh, you know, it would be kind of nice if I knew, like, okay, well, how much did this chick spend, and why is her video 20 minutes? Is it going to be, like, $300 haul, and I know I can't do it. But I just wanted to be upfront with you guys because I thought that would be fun. So let me know in the comments if you like it. Definitely give this video a thumbs up. I really appreciate it. I hope you guys are having a wonderful weekend, and I will see you guys real soon in my next video. Love you so much. Bye.